Good afternoon. Welcome to my hometown of Las Vegas. I'm so sorry that I'm not able to be with you today, but I want you to know that I support your work and look forward to partnering with you in my fight to bring more diversity to the United States Senate. I want to thank Charlie Garcia, Chief Executive Officer, Yvonne Garcia, Chairwoman, and Ileana Musa, Chairwoman of the Corporate Advisory Board for their strong leadership at Alpha. I am a proud descendant of immigrants, as I know many in this room are. My great-grandfather on my mother's side immigrated from Italy, and my father's father from Chihuahua, Mexico. My grandparents and great-grandparents came to this country for the unique opportunities this country offered, the opportunity to create a new and better life. My family's American story is one of hard work, perseverance, and finding opportunity. That family experience motivated me to begin a career in public service. And after working as an attorney in the public and private sectors, I realized it was time to step up and use my voice to be a leader on the issues I cared about. I ran for Attorney General for the state of Nevada and won. I had the honor of serving Nevada as Attorney General for eight years. Now, many people ask me how it feels to be the first Latina in the United States Senate. I tell them it is an incredible feeling to, be, to make history, but for me, it's not just about making history. It's about bringing diversity to the United States Senate. This freshman class is the most diverse in history. We have 21 female senators, but that is not enough. It's about having a seat at the table. Latinas in America deserve a seat at the table to make sure their voice is represented, not just in government, but in corporate boardrooms too. And it's about showing future generations that their race or background does not limit their future. I am honored to receive the Latina Excellence Award from the Association of Latino Professionals for America and I am proud to serve as a voice for Latinas in the halls of the United States Senate. Thank you for your hard work and commitment to empowering the next generation of Latino and Latina leaders in business.